Andrew Garfield has just come out and heavily denied his involvement in Spider-Man No Way Home. Carry on watching to find out the news. In a recent interview with Josh Horowitz on the Happy Sad Confused podcast, the amazing Spider-Man actor known as Andrew Garfield has recently denied his involvement with Spider-Man No Way Home, the Tom Holland sequel. From an article coming from MCU Direct, Garfield was quoted as saying that all of the rumors are hilarious. He went on to say that, dude, it's effing hilarious to me because it's like, because I have to do this Twitter account and I see how like often Spider-Man is trending and it's like people freaking out about a thing. And I'm just like, guys, 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 like, I wish I could be able to speak to everyone and say, I recommend that you chill. He then went on to say that, listen, I can't speak for anything else apart from myself. They might be doing something, but I ain't got a call. Andrew Garfield is here saying that basically he thinks that Marvel Studios could be doing something to do with an MCU Spider-Man crossover with other Spider-Men in the multiverse. However, he is denying that he is involved with said crossover, meaning that he will not be appearing in the film. He then went on to add, you know what it feels like though. It feels like because it hasn't come up yet in an interview, but like, you know that game, Werewolf or Mafia? I think it's kind of similar where you're convincing everyone that you're not the Mafia. Like, I feel like I'm in a game of effing werewolf or mafia where I'm like, not the werewolf. I promise you, I'm not the werewolf. And everyone's like, you're the werewolf. You're the effing werewolf. So basically, Garfield is referencing a game where you have to convince people you're not a certain type of thing. It's a game where you could be like, say, a werewolf, and then you go around and you eat people and you kill people, but no one knows who the werewolf is. It's basically like a game of Among Us is what he's trying to say. So pretty much... Garfield is stating that he's not in the film and he's trying to convince everyone that he's not in it even though no one will believe him because obviously with all these rumors coming out around Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield being in the Spider-Man film, it's like, well, you know, are you in it? Are you not in it? And then Andrew Garfield has now come out and said that he's actually not in the film. However, I will say this, even though Andrew Garfield has said he's not in the film, it is their actor's job to not say anything. Something that Alfred Molina did not do. Alfred Molina actually confirmed his presence in the film. However, actors like Tom Holland, Zendaya, and other actors around other MCU films, for example, have come out and said and denied things about the films, but then later on end up coming true. Just like Tom Holland has also said that he doesn't think there is a Spider-Verse in the movie, not one that he has been told about. And he told us that he read the entire script. However, then Alfred Molina came out and completely contradicted that statement by saying that his story picks up straight after the events of Spider-Man 2 in the river, meaning that that Spider-Man 2 character will be appearing in the film, which also then means that this is a multiverse movie. And if he's appearing in the film, it's very likely that Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man will also appear in the film. And if he's appearing in the film, then it's also very likely that Andrew Garfield could be appearing in the film. So there's a lot of conflicting statements going around about this topic. Some actors saying that they're not in the film and that this isn't a multiverse thing. Some other actors saying that they don't know if it's a multiverse thing, but they're still not in it, like Andrew Garfield. And then some other actors like Alfred Molina saying, hey, you know, this is a multiverse thing. You know, I'm in the film. My story is set up after Spider-Man 2 and, you know, we're going to take off from there and I'm going to be de-aged and all this and it's going to be the same character and everything. So we don't actually know what's going to happen in this film. Is it going to be multiverse? Is it going to be Spider-Verse? Will he appear? Will he not appear? Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you think Andrew Garfield will appear? Do you think he's lying? Tell me in the comments below. As we do know, No Way Home has now finished shooting, so Andrew would obviously not be on set, etc, etc, so he could lie about it. Let's just find out, shall we, when the first trailer comes out, or the second trailer, or when even the movie comes out. It could be a surprise for then. Tell me in the comments below what you do think about this news, and make sure to hit that subscribe button to not miss any more Spider-Man news in the future as well. Also, make sure to hit the bell next to the subscribe button to not miss any more content as soon as it comes out in the future. With that being said, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.